Well, it's take two. I have no clip, no well, no one showing up. So, I'm in no teacher's hand. I'm sorry to think it's Twilight Zone. I mean, it's look at the sky. It's gray. It's supposed to be warm, but it's cold. Wait, it's Norway. What? In all actuality, I think my teacher might have said something about this last week. He was like, oh yeah, we may not have class next week because it's going to be all break. We was like, well, I didn't remember that till today, so that's a good thing. Plus, I wasn't the only one there. There were like four people, so it's like, and wasn't the only one who did that. So good for you, Stefan. But the only thing that would freak me out is if that rock wasn't there. <gasps> rock is there. I'm going to go kick it now. But... The only thing that was like, I almost remember that we, it was like, I'm not sure if my teacher from my other class said we didn't have school on Monday, but I mean, I guess she did. I don't know, but I don't know. I'm kind of hoping to learn the language, so I don't know where I'm going with this, but kick your rock so I can forget this Twilight Zone crap. Plus, I got some laundry to do. It's like, I don't know why I'm excited about laundry. I just am. I'm becoming an adult. Crap. No. No. Before the truck comes and gets me. Nailed it. Now we do the headings of the homes and we do the works and everything. Like one thing at the Magistua station in downtown Oslo that really freaks me the heck out. And I know I don't show a lot of stuff that's above PG on this channel. But this may be something that you have to see because it's, it's generally a what the heck moment. And what has society come to? I'll show you because it really freaked me out. My god, it's a beautiful look. It's fall. There's so many leaves on the ground and nothing falling out of the trees. Wait, there's one. Nailed it. Now introducing Bjorn Borg presents virtual reality. So basically what I'm interpreting from that, if you ever wanted a robot to love you like your boyfriend and better, you now you can with virtual reality. Brought to you by Bjorn Borg. I think. That's my, well, stop, stop swinging the microphone. So yeah, that was basically my what the heck moment with society. That I think robot technology, I mean one, it's amazing because robot technology has come thus far, but I don't think that that's supposed to be how robots are supposed to be used. I thought they were just supposed to be used for efficiency and work, but we might be changing that. And I don't want to see in the comments below, oh, Stefan, you're just a racist towards robots. No, I'm just uncomfortable with it right now. However, in the future, it may like evolve to something to where you can marry robots. That might happen. I mean, have you seen the movie Her? I got, um, what was his name? Joaquin, was that Joaquin Phoenix? It was someone. He fell in love with the, like a IO unit, like Siri, and it was weird. And it, it's, it's becoming something that might be real. and. That's just something you're gonna have to get used to, I guess. So, in the comments below, tell me what robot you might fall in love with. Would it be R2-D2, C-3PO? I don't know, pick something. Or would it be like that floor vacuum cleaner? I don't know, would you wanna marry that? I don't know, it's your choice. I'm the future's up for grabs. God, house searching is fun. Look at all these sticky notes. I made sticky notes to help me figure out. I'm searching for housing. Yeah, adult chip wall nailed it things but yeah i'm looking for housing now and i found one that i really loved but some of the application stuff isn't working really well so mission tomorrow we're gonna go to university again not for school well, kind of for school work too do school work kids always keep your studies on your hands but i'm gonna get in there i'm gonna try to get the application through and we're gonna find some awesome housing i found one i loved it it seems amazing people and housing and wardrobe and everything and art and theater er, everything but take initiative kids and with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed today's weird video about virtual reality and housing and no school stuff and things like that i hope you subscribe share like comment with good news i hope you subscribe to our friendly channels michael gallo shalene screen santi and lena and frankie j grande and Ralph hardo hope you guys have a great day and Ubu signing out